small. Watch the clock ticking off the headphones. Uh, right now, my favorite. Spend my coin for show. I'm gonna be myself, or I could be someone else. No one's stopping me now. What is up, y'all? It has been a minute. I keep saying that because it has been. I've had so much that I have wanted to do, and just with school and working out and work, I just did not have the time. But today is Sunday, and I have a little free time. So, we are going to, as you can probably tell with the title of this video, go through my gym bag. So, obviously, first thing first, if RK would get out of my shot, he just likes the camera. Um, but first thing first, obviously, my bag. So, I absolutely love this bag. I got it at Academy. Um, I don't remember exactly which one it is, but it has all sorts of different pockets. It's got this front pocket here, obviously the main compartment. Um, this little side mesh pocket and then this shoe compartment which I don't really use. I need to though because I need to get back on my cardio game but that's a different story. <laughs> so almost every workout I have some sort of jacket either on me or in my bag. Today it is my Alphalete cropped hoodie, which I talked about in my favorites video. So if y'all haven't seen that, go check that out. Uh, I also am hopefully gonna be doing a like total Alphalete haul with all of my favorite pieces because right now they're hands down like my favorite active wear company. But we'll get to that later. So, probably the most important thing you can have when you go to the gym, headphones. I recently got these. These are from Exio Audio. I think that's how you say it. Uh, they're like the wireless earbuds. Uh, I absolutely love them. They have three hours of charge. This little battery pack has another 15, so I can go about a week and a half without charging them and they do stay in your ear. They're amazing. $50. $50. 11 out of 10 recommend these. But I do forget them sometimes and I need to charge them or whatever reason they're not working or I don't have them. I do have probably one too many pairs of backup headphones. Uh, I have my Beats uh, Power Beats wireless. These are really old and really, you know, gross, but. And then I also have my over the ear beats with my XEO Audio adapter, which makes them wireless, which was also in my previous video. So go watch it. The second most important thing for when you're at the gym pre-workout. My go-to right now is the Run Everything Labs EWP White in the flavor, <laughs> flavor Appleberry. It gives me just enough get up and go without feeling tingly and scratchy and I don't feel a crash from it. So. Up next is my green Intex band. I use these, this, for pull-ups. Zach bought the whole set off at Amazon, but this is the only one that I use for banded assisted pull-ups, cause I can't even do a single pull-up and that's still a goal of mine. Yeah. Another thing I keep in here, which I probably use a good amount of the time, is my little jump rope. 
Uh, I got this at Walmart for like two bucks. Uh, I'll do it sometimes for cardio or as a warm up. Just throw it in there when I need some extra exercise. Yeah, this is probably like one of the best cheap things you can have to keep in your bag. When I am when I am lifting super heavy and I I have weak forearms, let's just put it that way, and my grip strength's not the best. So when I'm trying to go heavy but I don't want my forearms or my grip to give out before the actual muscle I'm trying to work goes out. These bad boys. I believe they're from Strong Liftwear. Zach bought them for me. Yeah, Strong Liftwear. Uh, a really long time ago, probably like three years ago. They've kind of been beaten a little bit, but they still work and they do what they're supposed to. If you don't know what these are, so you take them and put the little velcro through there to make like a wrist cuff and then you stick your hand in there, tighten it, and then you wrap this part around the bar, the dumbbell, whatever you're using. And it just helps you to not have to focus on your grip grip strength or your forearms given out, it lets you focus on the muscle you're actually trying to work. Another wrap I use are these, I'm not even going to try to say it, har harbin Harbinger wrist wraps. These are because I have very weak, <laughs> I have very weak wrists. Uh, so when I'm bench pressing or dumbbell pressing, normally any pressing movement, uh, you take these and you just, that's backwards. You just wrap it around nice and snug and then it gives your wrist more support, more stability so you're not bending it or Up next, I have my handy dandy Run Everything Labs funnel. Uh, this bad boy has a little cap on both the top and the bottom. So you can store like a scoop pre-workout or I normally keep my carbon hydrate intra workout BCAA type thing in here. Uh, so then I don't have to carry the whole container. It takes up just a tiny little bit of space in my bag and I have it with me. And of course, because you know, nobody likes to look like shit at the gym. I mean, sometimes it happens, but I have my hairbrush and then also for those really bad hair days or those really hard cardio sessions, I have my Her Hustle headband. Her Hustle fell off, and I'm not even sure she sells this pattern anymore, but I normally keep this one in here because it's black and it goes with everything. And then lastly, I rarely ever use this. It's kind of like just in case I go work out at the rec because you have to have one, but I keep this towel in my bag. I actually got this when I went to um, a Tone It Up event in Houston with one of my friends. It was a lot of fun, but we're not going to get into that. So, Well, that is it guys. So those are my gym essentials. What is in my gym bag? Yeah, I'm going to try to link everything in the description box below. If you have any questions, leave me a comment, hit me up. Be on the lookout for my next few videos. I have a lot I'm working on, a lot I want to do. My next one will most likely be uh, either Alphalete or Run Everything Labs reviews. And then because it is almost October, 
I want to do a September favorites video and then also I'm working on a pumpkin spice haul you know because fall yeah so look out for those like subscribe follow me on Instagram if you made it this far thank you for watching love y'all so much